At a certain point after an inspection, you'll realize that you have eight frames or more of built wax in your bottom box. At this point, it's time to add a second story to your house. Adding a second box is a very simple step, but it's also a super important one. If the bees feel like they don't have enough room to grow and enough open space to continue building wax, they're gonna have the instinct to swarm and you're gonna end up losing half your hive, which you really do not want. The first step in adding a second box is to get a new bee box with 10 frames inside. And you're gonna place it on top of your outer cover flipped upside down. So just like that. What we're gonna be doing is moving two frames of honey or at least just built wax into the upper box. So in preparation, I'm gonna take out two frames and I'm just gonna put them to the side for the moment for later. In your upper boxes, you're always going to want to arrange your frames in a built, non-built pattern. So in preparation for that, I'm gonna take one frame and I'm just gonna move it to the center like that so I have a space open on either side to move my frames and I won't have any issues. The reason why we want to have this built, non-built pattern is to encourage the bees to build wax as quickly as possible. So if they feel like there are empty spaces in between built frames, they're gonna build there a bit more quickly than they would if there weren't. Okay, perfect. So I'm gonna open my hive up again. And so during my inspection, I already identified which two frames I'm gonna move up. So I have one frame that's more just built wax, and I have another frame that has a lot more honey on it. Very slowly, I'm gonna move the frame from my frame holder. So I've got a lot of honey on here. And I'm gonna slide it on, I'm gonna slide it into one of the holes that I've made. So now that I've added my honey frames and my frames of built wax into the upper box, I need to fill the spaces that I made down below. So as you know, we always want to keep the brood concentrated together in the center of the hive. And so we're going to leave them like that. So you've got your brood in the center. On either side, you have your two new frames. And then on the extremities, I have the remaining frames of built wax. So that's perfect. Our next step, our next step is to move our second box on top of the first. So I'm gonna remove my frame holder. I'm gonna put it to the side. And I'm gonna bend my knees so I don't hurt my back when I lift up the box. And very slowly, I'm gonna place it on top. And so the way you're going to place your boxes on top of each other is by putting the back end on. Whoop. OK. And then at an angle, you're going to slowly move it down. So from now on, during your inspections, you're really going to want to keep in mind how much space the bees have to grow. So the minute your upper box gets to be at eight frames or more of built wax or of honey, you're going to add another box on there. And you're going to turn your duplex into a triplex, maybe even a quadruplex.